Weather wise out there tonight, there are two big stories that we're talking about in tonight's forecast, and that is one, the heat and two, the rain that's moving through with the Wyndham Friday night football and any plans you might have. I want to get you up to date where with these showers are going to be moving into. I want to show you though that if you are in Guilford or Randolph along with Alamance counties, you're clear for now. That'll change a little later tonight. Some light showers moving into Davidson County, but the real focus here has been on Wilkes County and then up in Surrey County along with Yadkin County. I want to get you right down to Yadkin County. That's where we've had reports of some thunderstorms along with heavier rain here. So in the East Bend area, but along with these streets, if this is your neighborhood, you're certainly seeing some rain right now. Forbush Road, McAdams Road right here on Simplicity Drive, seeing rain in that area that's fairly heavy. And then if this is your neighborhood right here on Martins Mill Road, Friendship Circle Road, or Pecan Ridge Drive, seeing more rain there. I like to give you street level looks because this is where the rain's going to be headed on Nina Street and Justice Circle. Some light rain in the area for now, but this heavy rain is going to be pushing down and that's where it will be moving. Tonight, our entire viewing area, the Piedmont Triad, at a marginal risk for any activity we have to potentially turn severe. And the main threat there would be the winds. Nothing severe yet, but essentially here's what a marginal risk means for you. A few storms could be close to or become severe. Now winds will be up to or above 50 miles per hour and hail would be just under an inch, but hail not a huge risk for that tonight. Tomorrow you're in excellent shape. No risk for anything at all as far as a thunderstorm is concerned. And so if you're going out to the Wyndham, you're gonna have a great day for that. Mostly sunny skies. Now let's talk about the heat because it's been a very, very hot day out there. These are temperatures. We're at 92 in Lexington and Thomasville. 92 degrees in High Point along with Greensboro. We're at 94 degrees over in Burlington, 96 down in Siler City and 93 degrees in Asheboro. So we have heat advisories in effect until six o'clock right here in Chatham County and Montgomery County. Those are the only two counties affected by this heat advisory. However, it feels like it's in the triple digits pretty much across our area. It feels like it's about 103 degrees in High Point, 102 degrees in Burlington and Siler City. It feels like it's about 101 degrees in Lexington and Thomasville, and it feels like it's 100 degrees up in Reedsville right now. So I'm going to keep a close eye on that, and if they extend the advisories at all, which I do not think they will, we'll keep you updated on that. But tomorrow, more advisories could go into effect. It's going to be another hot day in the 90s. This evening, 82 degrees, partly cloudy with isolated thunderstorms. Overnight tonight, 71 degrees, mostly cloudy. The isolated thunderstorms storms continue, but actually start to die down just after sunset. The rain, though, could continue in the overnight hours into early, early tomorrow morning. But by tomorrow morning, we clear out beautifully. 90 degrees and sunny skies, light winds out there tomorrow. Over the next seven days, we will be in the 90s uh, throughout Sunday and then the 80s for Monday, but the upper 80s, so I'm not going to discount that humidity. Now, humidity is going to go way down from what we feel today into the weekend. So at the Wyndham, I know they have these little misters, Neil, that you can go get in front of and it'll kind of spray oh, yeah. you with water. You'll feel good. Yeah, you push so, a button and it starts. Yeah, it yes. feels really nice. So just make sure you're drinking plenty of water. But for Football Friday tonight, I would take the poncho just to be safe. Yeah, and it, yeah, but may not want to do the umbrellas because that'll block people's view. Yeah. But yeah, the poncho will work well. Good idea. All right, Kate, thank you. Sure. We'll be right back.